Hi, this is Andy for DigitalTrends.com and I'm at Digital Optics at Mobile World Congress and they make these extremely interesting new camera models, modules. Here's a demonstration of what they've got. Uh, incorporating one of our micro uh, mechanical elements, MEMS Autofocus, uh, capable of uh, doing everything that any other camera is doing on the market and then some. Uh, one example of the new features in the top of our actuation technology is the multifocus. Uh, multifocus allows you to take an instantaneous sequence of images and then capable of uh, uh, refocusing after uh, the image has been taken. An example here, uh, basically we have a, a, a scene with a certain depth uh, and the user can actually click on various parts in the image to actually uh, achieve the focus of choice. Uh, this is a, 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 a feature that uh, is done without uh, losing uh, resolution, without uh, losing lateral resolution, and uh, it's, uh, best in our knowledge, uh, the first of its kind on the on the market. Uh, so this is uh, basically one of the cars that is in very close focus. This is the Infinity, and then in between you can basically have all sorts of levels of, uh, of uh, uh, focus depth. We have a hardware face detector that is capable of de uh, detecting faces with a speed of under 33 milliseconds. Uh, and uh, it's uh, going to help with the uh, help of the face detector, we're going to show instantaneous focus on the face. So basically, the, actuation is, the actuator is focused on the uh, closed range here. And the minute faces come into, sc into screen, they are instantaneously uh, locked upon not only locked upon but also tracked with very very high speed as we move around the face uh, in the in the scene and uh, again this is a, a very important feature for uh, for video for uh, uh, taking the, the your daily uh, videos uh, with very little power consumption since everything is done in hardware in form factor smartphone with our mems cam in it this is running on the uh, both a fujitsu isp as well as a mediatek 6589 quad core processor so we've sort of shown one of our first uh, in-form factor 